Welcome to Kukja Gallery. Located in the art of Seoul by the iconic National Museum of Modern and Contemporary Art, the gallery has welcomed an esteemed roster of industry leaders and a wide range of art enthusiasts since 1982, standing as a living symbol of Korean contemporary art history. In 2018, Kukja Gallery launched its first ever outpost in Busan, which has been a major cultural hub in the region ever since. Kukcha Gallery recently welcomed a milestone moment in its history and a new beginning with the reopening of its historic K1 building. Modeled on the concept of a multi-use arts complex, the renovated K1 space features an expanded gallery space, a trendy cafe and restaurant area, along with a state-of-the-art wellness center. First seen is the expanded gallery space that faces the sunlit streets of Samcheongdong. The L-shaped window allows Kukja Gallery to interact with its community. Visitors can gaze outside the window to enjoy classic views of the city, while passers-by can also look at the art inside the gallery. Indoors, there is a lobby area for visitors to sit down and relax. Across the expanded gallery space is Cafe at the Restaurant, set up with an open terrace facing the stone walls of Gyeongbok Palace. A longtime favorite of both gallery visitors and the general public, the cafe holds a strong presence in the Samcheongdong area. Seen inside the cafe are the graphic designer Na Kim's colorful murals surrounding the walls. Customized to fit the cafe, the site-specific installation brightens up the atmosphere by adding a colorful rhythm to the space. Given the opportunity to redesign the walls, Kim revisited a work from her past exhibition at Kukja Gallery and rearranged it to adapt it to a new space. On the second floor is the gallery's fine dining space, the restaurant, which presents the contemporary artist Hegyu Young's works along with contemporary European cuisine comprised of seasonal menus. The celebrity interior designer Teo Young directed the space from its furniture to the lighting, mentioning that he was inspired by the collector's homes he had visited. Displayed on the walls is a partial rearrangement of Yang's eclectic totemic created in 2013, which adds a unique artistic atmosphere to the dining area. Yang's installation from her Solo Wit Upside Down series is first seen suspended from the ceiling. The work refers to the geometric structures of Solo Wit, juxtaposing restrained modernism and distillation of the avant-garde. On the third floor is Wellness K, the first ever gallery run fitness and well being studio in Korea. Wellness K also features an outdoor terrace that provides a space for relaxation. At Wellness K, members can enjoy group exercises including yoga, meditation, and weight training programs. Art displayed across the facility offer creative inspiration while supporting self care and spiritual well being. Professional trainers provide personalized programs for each member. At Wellness K, exercise is done alongside breathtaking views of the changing seasons, Gyeongbok Palace, and the Inwang Mountain. At Wellness K, Kukja Gallery aims to cater to the needs of clients by developing a regimen that integrates art into fitness. Kukja Gallery's K2 welcomes visitors with an array of exhibition catalogs, which form a crucial part of the extensive gallery archive. The catalogs involve written contributions by curators, critics, and other writers. For employees, Kukja Gallery presents a comprehensive archive dedicated to the scholarship of Korean art accessible in person and online. Located outside K2 is the gallery's outdoor garden, where many contemporary artworks have been installed throughout the history of the gallery. This garden is also used for events and socializing during opening receptions. Seen here is our K3 space. Created by the architectural firm Soil, 
The building has been internationally acclaimed by receiving the American Institute of Architects New York Design Award. At the moment, the Korean media artist unit Astrix solo exhibition is being held in the K3 space. Titled Starry Beach, created in 2020, the installation explores the potentials of media art by portraying the visual and sonic characteristics of water. With everyone undergoing social distancing this summer, the installation has been dubbed as the perfect urban getaway. Across its three buildings, Kutra Gallery remains committed to introducing exhibitions that display critically acclaimed works of art, along with exceptional curatorial integrity, providing insight to the practices of both Korean and international contemporary artists. Stay tuned for an enriching artistic journey ahead, and thank you for watching.